From the east to the west, I'll bury ya Like I'm on a jet in an airbite with America It's awfully fun, the boss has come versus an army I love it when it's all for one What's going on, DSG? It's your boy Donald Bradley back at y'all with another video. And today, we got Blue Beetle official trailer. Yo, let's get it. Now, I'm not like crazy familiar with Blue Beetle um, as far as like comics and things like that, but I do know him uh, from uh, like Teen Titans. I, I watch all the um, DC animated stuff, uh, so I, I know him from those. Uh, so it's really cool that he's finally getting like his own like like movie i honestly out of characters to get their own movie i wouldn't have pegged blue beetle for like this early on you know what i'm saying i i don't know i don't like i don't know who came first as far as comics or whatever 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 or but as far as like prominence i would uh i'd have thought maybe you you might have got like a raven or like a starfire or they might they might want to be like holding those back you know what i'm saying but i'm i'm definitely gonna be there for the raven movie when they do that that's without a doubt but we in here be sure to like be sure to subscribe follow me on all that there social media we hear that any further don't three two one click excuse me oh he Mr. big boss Reyes. you finished scraping the gum off that lounger or what psych <laughs> i guess not <laughs> sorry sorry oh god Oh man, like from uh from the thing I saw the things I saw in the uh, the animated films, I know that he he doesn't live like a lavish lifestyle. You know he came coming up hard, um, so opening up definitely threw me. Like definitely had had me for them for them first seven seconds. So I'm I'm not, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie to you, but all right, let's go. Reyes, <laughs> that was good. You finished scraping the gum off that lounger or what? Oh. Hey. Everything right now feels so out of reach. You always land on your feet, bro. You're hymen. They don't get out much. <laughs> I just wanna rap. Jenny? I just wanna rap. Okay. Alright, so we get in origin story. I actually do not know um his origin story. Um don't think I've seen anything on it or, or read anything on it, so before this movie like hits hits i'm actually going to do more of a deeper dive into the character find out about him uh just so that like you know i can have that for the movie um because there are sometimes i go in blind because i just want to be i want the movie to, to to entice me into actually looking more into the character but i think i want to know a little more going in on this one um but yeah so it looks like yeah, it looks like we're getting the origin story and that's the beetle i assume so this was okay. Wait, y'all ever seen uh, Public Enemy Number One? That one, Will Smith, back in the day. You know what I'm saying? Somebody would just run up on you. Hold this. I gotta go. Like I don't want to hold that. I don't want to hold that. Get that away from me. Stop. Excuse me, criminal. <laughs> Guard, I bet you life, but do not open it. You went in to get a shops, and nah. all you brought back was a hamburger. Okay, I don't think it's a burger. You haven't looked. I was the told hell not is to. That? It's not a burger. <laughs> It's fries and a scarab. <laughs> okay, I don't think it's a burger. You haven't looked? What the hell is that? How did you get it to do that? I think he likes me. Uh, it's on your face! <laughs> I'm sorry. It's on your face! No shit! Oh, God. Yo, 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 yo. There are just some people you can't have a crisis moment around, bruh. There are just some people in life you cannot have a crisis moment around. And, like, you don't want them panicking while you're getting fucked up. You know what I'm saying? Like, I need you to I need you to start activating. I need that homie. I need that homie card to pay off. Or that look like daddy. That look like his father or something. Oh, but look like he about to help. <laughs> I think he likes me. Oh, my God. No, it's not, it's not a dad character. Oh, my God. Hey, man. Wait, is that? Hold on. Is that George Lopez? Wait a minute. Oh God. That is George Lopez. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Let's go. Let's go. Remember? Remember? Yo, that looks mad sick, though. This ain't what you want. This ain't what 
Who said that? Okay, it's gonna be okay! That suit, whatever it was, needed to have some kind of receptacle. Because I would have lost control of all bodily fluids. <laughs> I'd have lost control of all that. I'd have been out of every orifice. It would have just been really bad in that suit. If there wasn't some kind of... And I assume there is because it looked high tech. You know what I'm saying? But I'd have, that'd have been wraps. That would have been rats for your boy. The suit would have been, like, and I hope, well, it seems like they're emphasizing on it because, um, as the character itself, they have a, um, uh, there's a, um, the suit is alive. There you go. The suit is, is the scare, but it has a mind of its own, really on some, like, think if, if, if Jarvis had an attitude, if Jarvis, right, had an attitude and was still the Iron Man thing, you know what I'm saying? That. You just take over the suit. Like if Jarvis had his own agenda and its own personality attitude type thing, well Iron Man, this is what this what you this what you get over here because this did this, this this suit different. But let's go. It seems like they're gonna like emphasize on that in the film. So it's cool that you know when it comes to these men, you don't know what they're gonna be taking away and whatever, whatever. Okay, it's gonna be okay. Yeah, I'd have lost all of that. I wouldn't even been able to experience that. I'd have been unconscious. I wouldn't have had to worry about none of that. I'm sorry. I wouldn't have had to worry about not one thing right there. You know, I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. Like, I would not have been home. I would not have been home. The minute I saw the Earth like leaving, I'd have been like, the suit's taking me wherever. And I'm, I'm. You know what? Since this gonna be an in-flight thing, I'm just going ahead and take a nap. <laughs> I wouldn't have to worry about none of this. <laughs> This ain't what you want. This ain't what you want. Oh. What is going on? I just want to rock. It's called the Scarab. It's some kind of world destroying weapon. It's designed to protect its host. This ain't what you want. Sometimes it does what you want, and sometimes it doesn't. Body out of your I, I, I think I cut a bus in half. The Scarab chose you. But it belongs to me. Hello. I'd have been like, get this thing. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what he was like um, at some point in time. Um, but my th uh, this is looking good. I'm liking where it's going. Uh, I do wonder how it's going to incorporate with the other DC stuff. Because I know the DC train has switched a couple tracks. So, you know, things are a little up in the air. I know we got Flash hopping in around the corner. Um, so I wonder how they're going to tie this in, but it looks like they're going in a very nice, uh, decent direction, you know what I'm saying, with the whole diss, don't say nothing, but he does know that girl, um, becoming whoever now, and just not, not really understanding and figuring out this suit has a mind of its own, so they're staying, so from what I know of the character, they're, they're staying pretty decently, uh, with it, like I said, I don't know how close this is actually to his origin story, but I'm talking about his relation to the scare, but alright, let's go. <laughs> But it belongs to me. The low you feel for your family makes you weak. I just wanna rock. Why he hit so hard? Yo, I, I'm sorry. I love the fact that George Lopez is in this movie. Like that's that solidified this for me. The universe has sent you a gift. You have to figure out what you're gonna do with it. That's my heart. One, two, three, four, five. Whatever you can imagine, I can create. Let's go. Let's party. Oh, yeah! Nice choice. I just wanna <laughs> Let's go. That man said, who? Magic <laughs> Devil May Cry Sword. Let's go. It's like Batman stuff. Batman's a fascist. I just wanna rock. <laughs> it's like Batman stuff. <laughs> wow. Yo, yes, yeah. Oh, wait, what are these? Read where it all began. Oh, okay. Hold on, I need this info. But uh, yo, that was dope. And we watched that dope stuff here too. Hey, yo, I like that. I'm interested to see this. I'm really glad that they gave us this. Well, gave, yeah, gave us this comic information because I'm gonna read these. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just go ahead and do that now. Uh, 
to see uh, how the character started up, like how close they are actually connecting to his true origin story and things like that. But um, I'm, I like the trailer. I like the trailer. I like what they're doing. It looks like it has a, a lot of good um, action and funny. I love it. I love it when 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 the when the comedy is right. Like in the last Thor movie, they overdid it a little bit. You know what I'm saying? The movie has started to become like a parody of itself a little bit. Um, but like the stuff they did, but the stuff they had been doing up to that point was like like perfect. You know what I'm saying? I feel like uh, this is definitely hitting on that. Uh, did a good job with Shazam. So like between between action and comedy. I'm gonna be very interested in uh, seeing that with it, but yeah, like I, I feel like they're the the connection between uh, how they're doing it and the character as far as the relation to the suit, how the suit has a mind of its own and things like that. Yeah, they're staying true to that, and it's it's just gonna be interesting to see because how the how do be fighting, Jaime? Have you have you how you be fighting uh, with the suit as far as like in the I think it was Teen Titans, Teen Titans versus Justice League, that one, yeah, how that suit almost X'd out, um, um, Robin, Batman's son, that one, yeah, suit almost took that boy out, mm, that was, that one, he almost became, he almost became a, 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 a dead pack, he was, a, he was a pack, period, but he was about to, he was just about to unexist, but yeah, man, we gonna catch that, that's take, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, follow me on all that dead social media, and I'll catch y'all next, fair, peace!